on day nine. We're on day nine. 100 burpees daily for 30 days. Woo! Last round. Glad you came to my channel once again. And if you're new here, glad to have you. Let's get into it on this video. As you can see, we're already in it to win it. We have a two minute in, we have two minutes out, and we're gonna be getting a full body 20 minute workout this morning. Uh, if you're new here, you already know that I'm going through a 30 day fitness challenge for 30 days. Today was day 11 on our 100 daily burpees for 30 days. 100 daily burpees for 30 days. Awesome challenge, it keeps you, it keeps you on point because you're just starting to get used to every day having some movement. When it comes down to the burpee, the burpee is a compound exercise. So it works out the upper body, lower body, and the respiratory system. You tend to condition your your respiratory so that's why it's always going to be a good deal to do daily burpees you can modify where necessary i have my timer here as you can see i'm always looking at it because we are going in and coming out we can't be resting too long if we rest too long you're going to cool down the heart rate goes down the blood stops flowing properly through the muscles getting that oxygen to the muscles so you have to have a time limit on, on your rest so i'm gonna be going back in on this video, I'm gonna just try to motivate you. I'm gonna teach you how to stay motivated. And that's kind of my main objective here on my channel. It's just to keep you motivated. I'm gonna give you some ideas on exercises, what to do, what not to do, how to do a proper exercise, usually calisthenics, body weight exercises, and you're good to go. We might do a little bit of free weight, as you can see here. We have one, two, 
three, four, five exercises, and we're good. Let's go into the last round. I always like talking about motivation, but there's something way more powerful than just simple motivation, and that is willpower. You have to be willing first. I can, we can talk about motivation all day long. You can try to motivate somebody. You can share with somebody how to get motivated, how to stay motivated, what motivated mission, what motivation consists of, all that. Cover the whole ins and outs of motivation. But if you don't have willpower, if you're not willing to do what you need to do, where you need motivation to do so, there's nothing there. You have to be willing first. It has to be, there has to be an importance in that aspect. Is it important to you to get in shape? Is it important for you to keep a fitness regimen? Is it important? Or you might not understand. You just don't understand how important it is in our lives. And that's the main thing right there. That's the bullseye. We don't understand how important it is in our lives. One thing that I would say here consistently is that we only have one life. So let's see how good we can build the body. Nobody should be living their life weak and unhealthy, but it is hard work and we can't, there, we can't get around that. There's no shortcuts. You can't beat around the bush. It's straight out just hard work, consistency, knowing what you're doing and you're good to go. If you want to take it up a notch, if you're already in semi shape and you want to start building some more muscle, get that aesthetic look or build a bigger muscle in a certain area, then that's gonna require more dedication, more consistency, more discipline, proper nutrition, proper rest, a little bit more. But if, you, if we're just talking about just getting in shape like a normal person, it's just what you need to get by and not have to be a superhero or an athlete or anything like that, then stick to the bare minimum. The bare minimum will be body weight exercises. You can do some free weights as well, but very low weight and you're good to go. Now, bare minimum will still cause some injuries. You're still prone to injuries if you're doing the bare minimum. So are you gonna be comfortable with bare minimum? I wouldn't, I wouldn't. Because sometimes we get out of our comfort zone. We wanna do something out of the ordinary. And in order to do something out of the ordinary, you're gonna be, you're gonna have to get to a level that's out of the ordinary, out of the just bare minimum. So yeah, we can talk about motivation all day long, but you have to be willing first, ladies and gentlemen. Let me go ahead and explain to, to this workout. I love the dips, you already know that. I, I love the dips with the parallel dip bars. Works a lot of the chest, works a lot of the lats, shoulders, triceps, all, almost the entire upper body, especially the chest. And from there we go onto the boxes. We do the, le, uh, the side jump squat, low squat, and then back to the box. Side jump squat is gonna work out a lot of the stability muscle and that's what we always hit is it's gonna be right here where the IT band is at. You're gonna hit the quads, the hamstrings, the glutes, the tibia muscle, the calf, the ankles, strengthening the ankles is gonna prevent you from twisting an ankle or tripping too easily. So you wanna do some stability muscle developing exercises. So that side jump squat is always gonna be a good deal. And then from there, as you can see, we went into the upper deck push-up, plyometric push-up. Very fun exercise. When it comes down to the plyometric, the upper deck plyometric, you gotta be careful with it. You have to be careful with it because you can miss the shelf 
you can miss the box and you're going down. So be very careful with this one. If you can't do a power push up, or if you didn't catch my last video on my one of my shorts, I did the Superman push up. Very awesome exercise, by the way. Awesome video. I'm gonna leave the link in the description box so you guys can check it out. It's a quick short to show you the Superman push up with an awesome ending. So yeah, the upper deck power push up or plyometric push up. Uh, from there, we went into the bicep curl with the 50 pound fixed barbell and then just regular jumping jacks. That's it right there, 12 repetitions each. Some of them are half. So it, if you count it all as six repetitions, we do six here, double count, six here with the boxes, six here with the upper deck push up, and then tw uh, six double count bicep curls, six double count side straddle hops. That's how you keep it, keep the number six and just some of them you just, add the double count to it but that's my workout for today as you notice in the beginning we did we're out on day 11 9 10 and 11 we just finished day 12 today 12 today no 12 is tomorrow so we finished day 11 today earlier and now tomorrow we're going to be continuing with the 30 day 100 daily burpee challenge uh, 12th day tomorrow so if you haven't joined me there yet and if you want to join you want to start from the beginning just start from the beginning the, go ahead and hit right here click right here and it'll take you straight to the beginning that way it gives you the tutorial on the burpee and see what burpee fits in your fitness level so but that's my workout for today 20 minutes i ran four miles earlier and uh, i did my 100 burpees and now i did a 20 minute a workout here with some plyometrics, some free weight training, some calisthenics. I'm feeling good uh, and uh, just shows you the dedication that's necessary for you to reach a pretty awesome explosive uh, form of activity. This is the kind of exercise that you want to do here but, but again remember you have to have that willpower in order to then utilize the motivation. So I hope this was a blessing to you. This, these videos here, I like to make them just to try to motivate you, maybe inspire you, maybe nudge you towards the right direction, remind you about something, because nobody should be living their life weak and unhealthy, but it is hard work, so you cannot escape that. There's no shortcuts. Don't try to do those crazy crash diets. Don't try to look for shortcuts. Go through this, go through whatever procedure, take pills and this and that. Don't do that to the body. The body is a, uh, an awesome specimen so take care of it take care of yourself we got things to do so we ain't got no time for weakness i'm gonna leave the video there i'm glad that you can join me by the way i'm trying to reach 500 subscribers so do me a big favor if that subscribe button is still red that means you haven't subscribed yet make sure you hit that subscribe button that way you help me reach those 500 subscribers that'll allow me to activate my community tab on my youtube page and now i can share with you guys workout plans more content on the community tab we'll be doing polls and voting and stuff like that so help me out to reach those 500 subscribers and hope i see you in the comment section hit that like button if you guys like these videos make sure you guys take care be safe be nice with each other always and forever mind body and strive